सो हेलो एवरी वन सो लेट्स डिस्कस सो वन क्वेश्चन इज डॉग लेग फील्ड रेडियोथेरेपी इज यूज फॉर सो दिस इज अ वेरी पर्टिकुलर फील्ड दैट वी यूज इन ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ टेस्टिकुलर ट्यूमर्स और सेमाइनोमा बट वॉट अबाउट लिम्फोमा सो लिम्फोमा सम ऑफ यू गॉट इट रॉन्ग लिम्फोमा द आंसर इज मेंटल फील्ड रेडियोथेरेपी ओके सो इफ दिस ए मेंटल फील्ड रेडियोथेरेपी थिंक ऑफ लिम्फोमा हेयर द क्वेश्चन वॉज डॉग लेग फील्ड रेडियोथेरेपी कैल्सिफिकेशन इज नॉट डिटेक्टेड बाय सो रिमेम्बर कैल्सिफिकेशन इज बेस्ट डिटेक्टेड बाय सीटी कैन बी डिटेक्टेड बाय अल्ट्रासाउंड एमआरआई बट नॉट बाय पेट वाई बिकॉज पेट इज अ फंक्शनल स्कैन बेस्ड ऑन मेटाबोलिज्म वाइल इट कैनॉट पिक अप अ स्ट्रक्चरल फाइंडिंग बट इफ दे चेंज द क्वेश्चन एंड से कैल्सिफिकेशन इज बेस्ट डिटेक्टेड बाय so definitely the answer is ct ct is better than ultrasound and mri to detect calcification but in this question i have asked it is not detected by and i want you to mark the answer as pet scan okay similarly let's see one more question here winking owl sign is seen in so what happens is if these are your vertebra on a ap view so if this is a ap view of the spine you can see the spinous process in the middle and you can see the pedicles on the ap view like this now vertebral metastases are known to cause destruction of the pedicle so if one of the pedicle is destroyed so this is how if there is destruction of one of the pedicle which should typical of vertebral metastases it will look like an owl which is winking to you so this is the answer here is vertebral metastases because of involvement of pedicle which iodine isotope is used for radio ablation that means treatment of thyroid in graves disease answer is iodine 131 iodine 131 is also used in radio iodine therapy of well differentiated remember this word it is important from your exam perspective well differentiated thyroid cancer half life of iodine 131 8 days produces both beta and gamma rays but remember the thyroid tissue is actually destroyed by the beta emission other choices in the question remember iodine 125 has a half life of 60 days and used for radio immunoassays and brachytherapy 123 half life of 13 hours used for thyroid functional scan okay and 124 used in pet scan so all four of them have medical use but answer to this particular question is 131 mushroom capsaicin so some of you must have gotten this wrong they must be thinking of pyloric stenosis but in pyloric stenosis congenital hypertrophic pyloric stenosis mushroom capsaicin is seen in barium study here it is in the mri so what happens is if this is your urinary bladder and let's imagine if this is your uterus so and this is where you have your rectum okay so if you have endometriosis if you have endometriosis in the recto uterine pouch now what will happen here is in the if you suppose you have uh, endometriosis in this area what will happen is this endometriosis will involve the recto sigmoid area and the mucosa overlying will be seen like this here so because this endometriosis looks like a mushroom cap so this is a sign of deep recto sigmoid or rectal endometriosis mushroom cap sign is seen on mri if you see endometriosis like what i have drawn in the diagram it looks like a mushroom cap very important question can be asked in future as well thank you very much i hope you enjoy the gts i again want you to know the most important component of success is mindset what is mindset mindset means that you might be visualizing these exams as big problem but when you change your perspective and you understand nahi hai zindagi mein aur bade problem aane ye to sirf ek exam hai aur balki ye problem hai hi nahi ye to ek opportunity hai exams are an opportunity to go to the next level so if you look at if you change your mindset if you change your perspective you start winning because when you look at exams as a gateway as an opportunity you feel more positive about them and padhna to dekho puri zindagi as a doctor so when you look at the entire medical career as a journey rather than as a destination you change your perspective you start improving i wish you all the best